What's up guys, it's Tyler Byers with Barbells and Barbecue. Pretty exciting, we're out here at Hall Farms. We are uh, doing our first wedding tomorrow. So actually a catering moment by Buddy Robs. So of course, gotta have beef brisket. Also doing some chicken thighs. Just finishing up seasoning here. So my rub typically consists of equal parts, kosher salt, 16 mesh, of course, black pepper. And then about 20% of that rub is also ground cumin. Just for that like aromatic effect. So a little secret there, but making sure I got all sides, which I have really. It's done really well um, method wise secret so you'll have to stay tuned till tomorrow and we'll show you what we're doing it's uh, the barbells and barbecue method so stay tuned we'll get that got the pit set at 225 um, doing a total of three briskets so next step is do nothing let it rest let it sweat get her on the pit she's going on all overnight and then the secret so stay tuned 30 minutes all right guys it's been about 30 minutes time to get her on the rec tech using uh, lumberjack competition blend pellets today. So I already got the two on. Again, I told you 225. Also, check this out. So we've saved all of the fat trimmings and also all of the meat trimmings. Grinded those, we are going to grind those up, use those for burgers. Video later, uh, vac sealed them, they're in the freezer now. So slide this on. So it's gonna render that fat. We also catch the drippings from the other brisket fats. So pretty awesome. Waste nothing, utilize everything. We'll get some probes in actually. Good tip too, the biggest. This is about a 10 pounder, probably around eight and a half after trim. So right between the two muscles. So I'm between the point and the flat with this. And then the smallest guy, farthest away from the heat. Adjust him a little bit. Same, between the two muscles. And we're looking for a finish Obviously color matters, but we're looking for a finish of that 203-ish temp, which should uh, we should reach that by about um, eight o'clock tomorrow morning. And then uh, we're gonna let them rest till the wedding. Stay tuned. You guys know what time it is? It's wedding season. Back here next day, Hall Farms. Cold brisket, temped at 202, but more importantly, the flat is just tender as can be. Great sign. We promised you guys a secret weapon, weapons. So we got the Weston commercial back sealer here, beef tallow, and our friend, the immersion circulator. So brisket, beef tallow, inside a vac seal bag, seal it. Got water temp set at 150 degrees. So we're gonna hold that until it's time. Stay tuned. So, an immersion circulator holds a liquid at a certain temp. The meat will never get past this point. Typically, we like to rest in a cooler on blankets, but this allows it to be at solid 150 the entire time. So it's at perfect holding temperature, ready. We don't have a, a hot box, so this is our hot box. What's up, guys? Time's come. Wedding bells are, ring are ringing, and uh, it's about time for us to start singing. So we're gonna uh, pull the last brisket we've already served. Have a few scraps there, chef bites. Uh, Got to pull this last brisket, cut it up, and uh, yeah, get it going. So, so they've been in the water bath for almost ten hours. So again, no different than uh, holding in a cooler or a warming box. It's just this method and get this guy set down. God forbid we waste these juices, waste nothing on barbells and barbecue, so pour those out in there. That'll make for a tasty bite later. And uh, get her going. See, you can see she shrunk down quite a bit, but slice her in half. Huh. Look at that. Smoke ring, rec tech did a heck, heck of a job. I'm gonna start with the uh, toughest part to stay stay moist, and that is the uh, point, or the flat, I'm sorry. Just like, just like what you want, fellas. So, pretty excited about that. 
but we're going to go how I like to take my bite, just a finish of a little bit of kosher salt. Wedding party's eating, so am I. Oh my god. They just said I do, and I do too. I would run across an open field in a hailstorm naked to get this bite. It's so stupid. I don't know what to say, really, to be honest with you. There's the point. Nice rendering of fat. Get a little burn in. What everybody wants. <laughs> Shut the front door. That's one of the best bites in barbecue. It's phenomenal. Cook perfect, probe tender, just what you want. Wedding party's happy, I'm freaking happy. Um, but yeah, it's been a great day. Happy to be a part of this wedding. Fixing to enjoy it, so uh, I'm gonna go in there, have a few more of these guys, maybe do a little dancing, probably not. Probably hover around the food, get the leftovers. But yeah, this is, this is phenomenal. As always, if you like this, smash that subscribe button, like, comment, share, give this a go. You will not be disappointed. This is just choice brisket, guys. Choice brisket, treated right, cooked right, done right. So uh, phenomenal. As always, I don't know. I'm going to keep snacking on this probably. Hurt the wedding party budget a little bit, but I don't care. Uh, anyway, as always on Barbells and Barbecue, we're lifting weights, crushing plates. Cheers. Crushed it. Like a brisket slice of pizza. What do you think? Mm-hmm. Winch over? Good. Oh,